we are given the equation 8 to the power x plus 27 to the power x divided by 12 to the power x plus 18 to the power x equals 7 over 6. We are asked to find the value of x. Now pause the video and don't forget to subscribe. Then try to solve it on your own. Welcome back. We begin by rewriting the bases. Open parentheses 2 cubed, close parentheses to the power x, plus open parentheses 3 cubed, close parentheses to the power x, over open parentheses 2 squared times 3, close parentheses to the power x, plus open parentheses 2 times 3 squared, close parentheses to the power x. This becomes 2 to the power x, all cubed, plus 3 to the power x, all cubed over 2 to the power x squared times 3 to the power x, plus 2 to the power x times 3 to the power x squared. And this equals 7 over 6. Let a equal 2 to the power x and b equal 3 to the power x. The expression becomes a cubed plus b cubed divided by a squared times b plus a times b squared. Using the identity for a cubed plus b cubed, it equals open parentheses a plus b close parentheses times open parentheses a squared minus a b plus b squared close parentheses. So the fraction becomes open parentheses a plus b close parentheses times open parentheses a squared minus a b plus b squared close parentheses over a b times open parentheses a plus b close parentheses, which simplifies to a squared minus a b plus b squared over a b, and this equals 7 over 6. Multiply both sides by 6. 6a squared minus 6ab plus 6b squared equals 7ab. Move all terms to one side. 6a squared minus 13ab plus 6b squared equals 0. Factoring gives open parentheses 2a minus 3b close parentheses times open parentheses 3a minus 2b close parentheses equals 0. Thus we have two cases. Case 1, 2a equals 3b. Case 2, 3a equals 2b. Substitute back a equals 2 to the power x and b equals 3 to the power x. Case 1, 2 times 2 to the power x equals 3 times 3 to the power x. This becomes 2 to the power x plus 1 equals 3 to the power x plus 1. Hence, x equals negative 1. Case 2, 3 times 2 to the power x equals 2 times 3 to the power x. This becomes 2 to the power x minus 1 equals 3 to the power x minus 1. Hence, x equals 1. Therefore, the solutions are x equals 1 or x equals negative 1.